This game is Dead Rising 2 off the record. My goal is to 100% beat the game and unlock every one of its 51 trophies for the shiny platinum. To achieve this, I'm going to have to kill more zombies than I've ever killed before. Yes, lots of zombies. Take many, many pictures. Some exciting, some not so much. Save brain dead survivors, complete all of the scoops, rid the place of some unwanted psychopaths, bring the very first survivor all the way through the game, while also not eating any meat, dairy or alcohol, and earn a gold medal on every challenge in the new sandbox mode. To join me as a 100% another Dead Rising game. After the first Dead Rising, Frank West had survived Willamette and become famous, starring in his own show and earning himself some money. It didn't last long though, his show got cancelled and Frank went bankrupt and began to drink. With little to no money left, my last resort was to take part in TIR. Terror is reality. You might remember this game show from my Dead Rising 2 video. The game is very similar, but does have a few new tricks. I also won't have to play that horrible multiplayer mode this time, so that's a win. Let's play TIR and see if I can take home some cash. Get off me, Frank ripped. And I've got a freaking belt. And he wears the belt while fighting. We got weapons. Get off me. We got a still chair. Terror is reality. Whoa, where's the arena going? Oh, this is crazy. Get out of here. I need to get back in the ring. Jump in the corner post to activate them. There we go. Oh, nice. Oh, God. All right, well, I'll take the silver. Now that I could afford some food, I head out until I found TK up to some shady business. So I pull out my trusty camera. Oh, there's TK. Oh, that's the crazy cure guy from uh, I never thought I'd get to do who we killed as a so psycho important. in Dead Rising 2. Really TK's still up to his funny business. We're playing as fr uh, Frank now though, so we can take pictures, which is a nice little change. Oh, he's got a briefcase of cash. I think they're on to me. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to fight them. Don't mess with Frank. He's a world terrorist reality champion, boys. Boom, boom. Oh, level up. Level 11. Got a new move. Still got it. Oh, speaking of level ups, you might have noticed I started at level 10. That's because I went into the new sandbox mode for a little bit and got a couple of levels. Oh, hi, twin. After showing those dudes what's up, it doesn't take long before shit hits the fan. Oh, no, he's right. Come on, friend, get out of there. Oh, God, it's happening all over again. Again. Oh, my God, Alice. Drake. Oh, I missed him. <laughs> I'm coming for you, Dale. Uh-oh. Look at all the PP. Oh, they got, like, a nice stage. Come on, oh, my God. Everybody's dying. Kale, Kale, whatever. Run up. She just got knocked out in one shot. Oh, she's dead. We need to get out of here. That intro was way more brutal than the than two. She's gonna need a, a new boob job. All right, we're off to the safe house again. Frank looks ridiculous with the face paint, Hawaiian shirt, and. Those ridiculous, like, puffy boots. <laughs> Emergency shelter. Get in there, Frank. Oh, hello, Sullivan. It's nice to see you again. Oh. So instead oh, yeah. of needing Zombrax for Kate, instead we need Zombrax for ourselves, because Frank is infected. Um, right, so we're going to have to go find our first dose of Zombrax now. Okay, so we're going to the pharmacy again, just like two. So I think, to my knowledge, a lot of this is very similar to Dead Rising 2, and this is just kind of a... It's kind of like an alternate reality, kind of a version of what if it was Frank who ended up here instead of Chuck. All right, so we've still got the time mechanic, still got the Zombrex. Three days until the military arrive, exactly the same. Uh, Co-op, which, thankfully, I don't have to play through the whole game in co-op, so I have to keep running between my uh playstation 4 and playstation 5 like it did for dead rising 2 so that's a win save at the bathroom as usual it did say as well because i've got a dead rising 2 save i get like a set of clothes damn look at that cyborg frank 
That looks pretty cool. I might rock it. There we go. We got Cyborg Frank. All right, let's go find these Sombrex. Here we are. We are back in the mall. We also get checkpoints, it seems, as well in this game, which is really, really handy. So Fortune City is where money is king. So we can smash ATMs for cash, the usual stuff, earn money, play mini games and slot machines, collect gambling magazines for a luck boost. Look out for money cases and security box keys that can lead you to big rewards. Oh, nice. We got a key here as well. Security box 001. All right, so since I'm going to be saving a lot of survivors, I'm going to do exactly what I did in Dead Rising 2. And I'm going to go and grab the leadership magazine. But it's in a different place in this game. Instead of it being in the strip on this game, it is in shop around here that one i think rag mags leadership so now any survivors that would have needed help uh, to move now don't which is very useful right, here we are roy's mart fantastic oh there's, there's his line fantastic are we gonna get his other line i've covered wars you know talking to you is giving me a headache oh yeah <laughs> wrecked <laughs> come on then fellas Boom. All right, got my key. Deal with some orange juice. Grab some more. There we go. Oh, look. Frank just kicks doors down. There we go. There's my first dose of Zombrex. So I need to take it at 8 a.m. All right, sweet. Let's go save. Dense. Yeah, I think there's actually a trophy as well we're going to have to get. I think we need to take her all the way through the game, like the whole way through, which is kind of insane. But that's for another playthrough. Come on, Dense, move your butt. Oh, God, she's being grabbed. Oh, wow, they lose health while they're grabbed in this? Oh, no. That's going to make things a little bit more difficult. In 2, when they were grabbed, they didn't lose health. Come on. So it seems... Oh, my God, she's being grabbed again. The survivors are probably... Oh, my God, I just German suplexed him. No, well, there's our first survivor saved. It's weird coming into this room and not seeing uh, Katie. Right, let's see if we can go take out Ted and Tame Snowflake. Uh, before we do that, let's see if the Zombraxes are still in the same places as well. The hell's that? Probe? Alien probe? I mean, that's definitely new. Oh, it's not. There's a katana there instead. Ooh, okay. That's interesting. I'm not going to be able to get the Zombrax as easy as I were in 2 because I knew where the locations were. They switched it up now, though, so I'm going to have to figure out where they come from. I would imagine it's probably those lockboxes. Obviously, I got lockbox one, didn't I? I'd imagine some of those are probably going to have Zombrex. Maybe they'll have, like, combo weapons, money, and Zombrex. All right, while we're in the food court, I'm going to go to Hungry Joe's and grab another book, the healing book. It's in here somewhere. Where? I'm not sure, but it's definitely around here somewhere. Okay, I couldn't find it, so I looked online. It's up here. That is a pretty tricky, tricky spot. Health 2, so that's going to give me 100% boost, so basically double. Now let's continue towards Ted. Well, shit. I wonder if we can actually still tame her. I want to say as well, real quick, I'm not going to go as in detail with some of the psychopaths, just because a lot of them are the same as the ones in Dead Rising 2. So if you want to see all of the psychos in more detail, uh, go watch my Dead Rising 2 video. For this one, I'm going to focus more on the the newer psychopaths. Uh, here we go. All right, Ted's still pretty easy. All right, poor Ted's down there. All right, let's feed her with a steak. Is it in the same place? Seems like it. All right, where are you at, Snowflake? What the hell? It looked like she was going to eat it. She was just like, nah, not today. I need to be careful. I'm going to get killed. Oh, there we go. She's eating that one from before. Go on, eat it. I think she's eating it. Nice. There we go. Snowflake has been tamed. Nice. Take Zombrex. Oh, we just do it right on the spot. All right, let's go save the dude that's hiding in here as well. Come on, Lenny. All right, let's turn the casinos on. 
And another trophy powered up. All right, now we need to quickly get back to the safe house so I don't miss case one. What the hell is this? Oh my god. Oh god, Lenny. Lenny, don't die on me, bro. Get in. Uh, we're almost there. I just looked as well. So in Dead Rising 2, we got a trophy for taming Snowflake. In this, we need to tame Snowflake, but we also need to have Snowflake attack a psychopath. So I'm not going to be able to do that now because I need to go back for this case. So we will do that in uh, on the second playthrough because you can't leave Snowflake outside because she can basically go through the entrances from any distance. Right, here we go. I wonder if Frank's going to get blamed now then. Okay, so it doesn't look like the frame in Frank. Because we can clearly see that's the crazy guy. So Kiora getting blamed in this one. Oh, nice. We got the maintenance key now as well. So we can do combo weapons. All right, here we are. Let's make some combo weapons. Spiked bat. All right. No when to fold them. We've got someone gambling. Oh, while we're here as well, actually. Let's make quick steps because it'll heal us really nicely. And of course, then we can run faster as well, which is a pretty big issue for me at the minute with uh, with us being low level, we've run so slow. So we'll get a couple of these, help us move around a little bit quicker. Basically just a combination of two wines, super easy. And this place has unlimited. Hey, look, it's Bill. He's gambling here instead of the, the other place. He was at the strip last time. I'm gonna have to pay him 25 grand again. Yeah, 20 grand. There you go. And then he's gonna want another five. Ripping me off all over again. Alright, come on, Bill. Ooh, combo card. Cryopod. That must be a new one. Come on, Bill. Is he stuck in his barricade? Alright, come on, Bill. You better not die. I've just paid 25 grand to recruit you. Oh, let's talk to the uh, this looter as well. He'll sell us Zombrets. I wonder if that's the main way of getting it in this this version of the game is to, to buy the Zombrets since we seem to get a lot more cash than we did in Dead Rising 2. Alright, let's see if he does sell Zombrets. He does. 50 grand a pop. Okay, so if we, we really need it, we can get it there if we can't find it anywhere else. Oh, there we go. You need to pay attention out here, buddy. We found Rebecca. Um, All right, let's get to the security room. Show you mine. Oh God, Frank! Where's your crew? Come on. <laughs> mm, oh God. Take me to the security room. Bill's coming along as well. I hope you don't mind. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, another security box. Six, nice. seven, three. Now oh, let's see if I can find a weapon for. For Bill, so he doesn't get grabbed as much. Yeah, Bill. Have that. What the hell? There's Lewis are chasing me. Bugger off, mate. No, there's looters everywhere in this version of the game. Just admiring your skills. Oh god. Frank's just as bad as Chuck. Looks like yep, place has been ransacked. Much. All right, so someone ruined the whole place, shot the security guard. So somebody's hiding the truth, and we're going to find out, because we are Frank West. And we've covered wars, you know. Yeah, let's buy one or two snap. Whoa, thank you, Bill. I'm going to have to heal him up. He's looking, uh, he's looking hungry. Well, that didn't really do much for heals, did it? But better than nothing. Oh, Bill, you just broke the freaking vending machine. I was using that to heal you. God damn it, Bill. All right, have your crowbar. All right, let's go. All right, so Frank believes it's not Cure. I mean, it technically is Cure because TK paid one of the Cure members. There we go. Case one complete. Next case doesn't start until half six. Wait, so where did Snowflake go? Heading back out, I wanted to test out my new skill. Ooh, a trophy. BFF. <laughs> so this is the vehicle as well I'm going to need for one of the trophies at some point. I need to get eight survivors in this uh, this vehicle. Just like the Snowflake trophy. We'll be doing that in another playthrough. For now, let's go and see if 
Chad and Doris are, are down here. Well, I don't see Chad. There's Doris, though. Need Chad first. I don't know where he is, though. Where is Chad? He's usually here. Oh, there he is. He's fighting looters. There we go. Right, let's get back in the vehicle. We got a level up as well. Oh my god, Doris, what are you doing? Uh, are you okay, Doris? There we go. Right, let's get the hell out of here. Kenneth's are almost dead, we need to move. Oh god, he just shot his wife. Alright, come on. Right, get in. No, Ken! We lost Ken. <laughs> Did Frank legit just say, I think she's a gold digger? <laughs> oh my god, Frank. Alright, let's get these two back to the safe house before they die as well. I feel like, I honestly feel like the them losing health when they get grabbed is a unnecessary change. Should we try the zombie walk? We can only do it for three seconds though. Oh, there it is. Oh, what the hell? I was trying my zombie walk out. The freaking Lua just threw a Molotov at my face. Rude. Oh, we got another call. Dancer throwing up. Oh, it's the puking lady. There she is. You coming with me, pukey lady? Hurry up and show us your dance moves and let's go. Oh, brilliant. There's those dance moves. Alright, come on. Out at the park? I get a cool surprise. Oh, I know who this is. This is cool. Hey! Look who it is! What's that boy, Chuck? Whoa, He's definitely seen Joe. better days. Hey, sorry. Didn't know it was yours. It's a nice bike, though. He looks sorry, super I rough. Thought you were one of those crazies. I just can't trust people anymore. He's got a freaking like doll of Katie on his back. These zombies. They're annoying, sure, but they're easy to kill. How kind of Oh god, yeah, he's definitely lost it. The real threat is the people. I mean, he ain't wrong, to be honest. An outbreak like this does things to men. The violence, the death, seeing loved ones die. Ooh. Change. Oh, so. Do you reckon... Because... In this game, Frank was winning the tournaments... Chuck couldn't get the cash to give Zombrex to Katie, so she turned. Yes. And then he's just completely lost his mind, the poor guy, and he thinks the doll is Chuck, uh, Katie. Yeah, oh, poor Chuck. I feel so bad for him. Back to the safe house so that get the hell away from her. Oh, crap. You're just one oh, no. You just want to hurt her. Keep her from getting her. Oh, here we go. Time for a psycho boss fight. And a freaking cool one at that. Nobody messes with my kid. All right, let's go, Chuck. I wonder if we can get him trapped like uh, we could the other geezer. Oh, he's throwing mollies. Why does everyone throw molotovs in this? Where's he gone? Oh, there he is. Yeah, looks like maybe we can get him trapped. Jesus. Okay, so he still kind of gets stuck, but not quite as much from the looks of things. I like the new vault as well. He like vaults over stuff now instead of the awkward little jump over that we had in the uh, in the other one. 
Yeah, he definitely doesn't get stuck as much. The AI has definitely been improved. Oh, pitch a chance. Oh, he's healing with that. This boss fight's no joke. It's proving way more difficult than I uh, than I thought. Oh, maybe like two more hits. Go on, Chucky. Yeah, we got him, and we got a trophy as well. Out with the old. Oh Jesus. Katie. 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 Oh no. I feel so bad for him. Are you all right? Katie. You're okay. You're safe now. Oh my god. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. Rest in peace to Chuck. No, oh, he says that in the uh, the original as well. That guy. I guess now we know what would actually have happened if if he did lose Kater. And um, we got his bike. Does it come with the chainsaws? All right, let's go save the four noobs playing the uh, board game. Brains over broad. Oh my god, the looters are back again. Are they just like? put looters in this version like everywhere i swear the you maybe saw a handful of looters in in the original where is this one they're literally just scattered all over the place at least you know when they're around because you get the uh you get that weird music all right here's the noobs and the looter's gonna chase me in come on fellas you're coming with me bring the board game with you it's fine oh my god these bloody looters there we go are right, you good now? Bro, what the hell? Chill. Alright, come on lads. We're getting out of here. These... Bloody looters. John's almost dead. I feel like I never get the survivors back in this one in, in like good condition. There's always at least one that's... That's just like teetering on dead. Ooh, trophy card collection. All right, so case two is going to start in 27 minutes, which is more like a couple of minutes in real time. Maybe if we watch these monitors for a minute. What the hell? Oh, it's the cure, dude. That's the guy I saw taking money from TK. Yeah. All right, looks like we're going to have to go check him out. Oh, there it is. I've covered wars. You know, <laughs> we got the line. So whereas this guy was just kind of a side psychopath, in the original is a bit more involved in this one so even though this one's very similar to two they've at least changed up enough stuff to make it feel feel new so the new area is called uranus zone i know brilliant name but we haven't been there yet so it'd be uh be cool to go and explore it properly there we are there's the new area oh a key security box 185 Still not sure where we uh, use those. Here we go, the new area. Yeah, this looks cool. We got rides, VIP access. I think there was a trophy as well to, uh, so I'm guessing these, we need to win at these these little mini games. I'm gonna do one real quick. I don't wanna spend too much time on it though, because we don't, we don't have the time right now. Oh, I am horrendous. Alright, I got one of them. Hey, and we got a trophy for it as well. We have a winner! Oh, there's loads of mini games. Look, I want to play more. Oh, we won again. Right. We've got loads of games, and I do want to play all of them. But I think right now we don't have the time. I don't want to mess, mess up any of the case files, so we'll probably try and do them all on our second playthrough. Hey, you, uh, you all right? I don't think he is. He's still got blood all over him.
Oh. Oh, he kills her in this. Still got the badass tune, though. Oh, I'm so low. Well, I'm kind of lucky he ran off. I don't think he threw zombies at me last time either. Last hit. Oh, what the hell? How did that not kill him? There he is. Get out of here. GG, my guy. All right, we just need to get our ass back over to the safe house. I really want to explore this place, though. Here we are, case three. All right, so she's saying he's he was new to Cure, and TK planted him in the group, and then just paid him. Oh, it's going down at the maintenance tunnel. Yeah, but here they are. I wonder if uh, Frank makes any noise like Chuck did. TK, time to take pictures. Okay. So. We didn't get caught like Chuck did. Let's take some pictures. He's dropping the stuff. Oh, now they've found me. Do we have to chase him down? Oh, he just jumped straight on the train. We don't even chase him on the bike. Capcom must have got word that uh, the bike controls like ass. So they were like, screw it. We'll, we'll just have him jump on instead. The enemies die a lot faster with a gun. Felt like they took a hundred shots in, in the original. So he didn't say he's behind it. Off he goes. Frank, Stacy, are you okay? Yep, we're good. Same as ever. That air piece is huge. What the hell? Yeah, so she wants us to take him out. She seems a lot more aggressive in this one than, than two. Ooh, we got a key, so we can get back into the maintenance tunnels. Nice. All right, next case starts at 1 p.m. All right, so we got Cold Blue. That's that one's Sven, and he gives us Zombrex. We really need to get that one done. And then in the original, there's Zombrex on one of these ramps. So I'm going to see if we can find it. Yay, the Zombrex. All right, we got one, finally. At least we know we're not going to die. Oh, there's Sven. Yeah, what's up, Sven? He's in a different location. Right, we're going to save him because then we'll get another Zombrex, so we'll have two. All right, come on, Sven. Can't let you die. I need your Zombrex. I think I'm going to leave. Should we leave one bitten? Because he needs a Zombrex. But if we save him, we'll have to give him another Zombrex as well. And that could prove to be bad. Mm, do you know what? I'm going to risk it and hope it doesn't bite me in the ass later on. If it comes down to it, though, I can go to the shop and buy a Zombrex for, I think it was 40,000 or 50,000. So that's kind of a last resort if we really need it. We'll get a picture of him taking the Zombrex. 1,600 points. Yeah. Come on, fellas. <laughs> Frank, it is. He's always got something, something to say, Frank. All right, let's go. I will say as well, I don't want to jinx it, but so far I've not had a single crash. Whereas in Dead Rising 2, the game would have probably crashed about five times by now. So that's a win. The freaking looters are chasing me all the way in. They, they really have gone so overboard with the looters in this game. They should have done it where... Like, once you kill the looters, they're either gone completely or they just don't respawn for me. Maybe like a day or two. So that should get me some Zombrex. Nice. I was kind of worried that maybe they changed it and it wouldn't give me any, but we're good. And we got a level up as well. New skill move. Get some fish. Oh, there's another key there as well. Security key 9999 nine, 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 nine. Damn, we're cutting this art appreciation super fine. I don't know if they can actually die while you're in the area though, so I might be okay. I need some more level ups so we can get more speed. That's what it is. Wait, who's this geezer? Wait, what the hell? Who's this guy? Are you okay there, bro? This guy's new. How do I get him up? These goddamn looters go away. They're so annoying. What? 
get something big and soft for him to drop on. Is that what it said? A big stuffed animal. Oh, God. Okay. Right, let's go get our appreciation guy before he freaking offs himself because no one appreciates his art. And then we'll go find some big soft stuffed teddy maybe over there. Yo, Randolph, I've come. I've come back. I appreciate your art. Three grand. There you go, mate. Uh, and we've got no daughter that we can give the picture to. So, sorry, mate. <laughs> right, we need a stuffed teddy. Ah, here we go. Right, where is he? There he is. I can see him in the. Di <laughs> I could just see him in the distance dangling. Yo, that guy's got some like Nathan Drake upper body strength. I'm telling you. I'd have fell off that thing after two seconds. <laughs> it reminds me of the two dangling in the. Uh, Dead Rising 1, if you remember those two. Right, Irvin joined. Happy days. Oh, for God's sake, these... Go away, bro. There's so many looters. Holy sh... Jesus, what the hell was that? I think I just shot myself a little. Oh, I can hear someone. Oh, it's Jasper up on there. Oh, does that mean Antonio's there then, the boss fight? Right, let's get Jasper, and then we'll see if Antonio's there. Oh my god! Oh, bro, them jump scares need to stop. Oh my god. There he is. Antoine, there we go. King of cuisine. Oh, he still thinks I'm a reviewer. I mean, it makes even more sense that I might be the reviewer because I got a camera and stuff. So no matter what universe it is, Antoine still cooks human. Not today, Antoine. Not today. Come on, then, bro. Where do you think you're going? You ain't going for that food, my guy. Get off that food. Come here, you little turd. Stop. I don't even know what you're eating there, but... <laughs> He's trying to throw food at me. <laughs> Come on, then. Get out of here, Antoine. Get out of my face. Jasper, what are you doing? <laughs> Jasper, help. <laughs> Jasper, get him. Help me, Jasper! Jasper, don't just watch! Yeah, there you go, Jasper, get him! Go on, Jasper, you absolute legend. Oh my, don't kill Jasper! Ooh, right, I gotta be careful, I'm low on health. Last hit. Oh, I'm last hit as well. Yeah, there we go, that was close. <laughs> we did it, Jasper, we did it. We're a dream team. Oh, he's gonna fall into it. Oh my god. Damn. Who's up for a little fried Antoine, the king of cuisine? Smell like chicken. <laughs> that does not smell like chicken. Oh god. Right, let's heal up and save Cinder. I've got your boyfriend Jasper. Let's get the hell out of here. Right, we're gonna grab some pasta before we leave. Jasper, have some pasta. Just think, if I didn't save you, Jasper, you might have been eating your girlfriend then. <laughs> Another key. 304. Still need to figure out why the hell I use them. Oh, the rockers have spawned. Let's go save them. Oh, we can get a picture of them as well. God damn it, zombies. I'm trying to take a picture. Go on, do your special move. Take them out. There we go. Not bad, not bad. I'm sorry, Alan, you didn't get in the <laughs> you didn't get in the picture. All right, let's get these three back to the safe house. And I'll be having my Zombrex very soon as well. There we go. Let's take this shot of Zombrex. I just saw this? someone carrying a bride into the swept away chapel in the Silver Strip. Kind oh. Of a weird time to get married. It's Randy. It's our boy, Randy. Right, we'll come back for Randy. Let's save these three first, because Randy's, like, ridiculously strong. I think, uh, is this the, the B introduction? Yeah, so if we uh, kill a bee near the zombies, all of the melons pop. Sure hope this still works. Just like that. All the zombies scattered outside. There he is. 
All right, let's go, Randy. Ooh, almost 5,000 PP for that. Damn, he's strong. Oh, he killed me. Oh, no. All right, round two, Randy. So the checkpoint system basically just spawned me right at the boss fight. That's that's pretty uh, that's pretty good. All right, I'm gonna have to try and be a little bit more careful. He's just spinning around. I let him run around. I think he like loses stamina. Oh, one last hit. There we go. We got him. Well, you can uh, get married to a zombie. There you go. Happily married. Well done, Randy. Well done. You may now feed the bride. All right, come on, Danny. We're going. Right. You know what? I'll leave his wife this time. Oh, it's the one where I need to be in my underwear, isn't it? All right, let's get Danny to wait over here, because I'm gonna have to go to that area to get the underwear. Oh, we got another thing. There's a young man stuck near the amusement park. All right, I definitely want to check that one out because I I really want to explore more of the new area. I'll be right back, ladies. All right, there's the underwear. Beautiful. Cracking, Chuck. Absolutely cracking. You all right there, fellas? Do you need something? Oh, you little... Oh, they're robbing me money. And my items. All right, I'm back, ladies. Is this good enough? I've got my camera, some underwear, and a giant pink chainsaw. Can you get any more embarrassing than that? Probably not. We're going to head over to... Water circle to forward, which is in the new Uranus zone. And I totally forgot to put some clothes on. <laughs> Yo, Eric. I got you, Eric. I got you. Just give me a minute. My hands are strictly for gaming. <laughs> okay. And help for... Tr oh, I've got to kill them all first. Okay. We don't want another repeat of what happened with uh, Andy, I think it was, in Dead Rising 2. Luckily, he's got no shotgun, so I think we're okay. If you know, you know. Another tournament. Fortune City Video Game Championships. Uh, well, I think they're on... Uh, I think they, they've been postponed. There we go. I thought I'd used my last continue. <laughs> okay. Oh, a reward. What is it? 45 grand? What a guy. Thank you. Alright, and then case 4-1 is going to start at 1pm, which is in... 15 minutes in game time, which is probably like a minute. Sabotage his own show. I'm sure he's got his reasons. So, uh, so Rebecca doesn't think it's him. Because why would he sabotage his own show? Oh, here we go. Oh, is this the one where they're breaking into the vaults? Oh, that means I might be able to use the keys. Stace is a bit of an ass in this one, to be honest. Alright, uh, anyway, we need to get our asses over to the vault. Get here. Ooh, a level up. Attack damage increase. And a new combo card, Hail Mary. There's a woman on the floor. Oh, is that? I think that's the tan lady. Is she the one that gives me the shortcut? I can't remember if she's the one that gives me the shortcut or not. If she is, though, I definitely want that shortcut. Oh my god, 75 grand? I just got 75 grand from that bloody, uh, briefcase. Oh, more cash. We get another 75 grand from it? 60 grand. Nice. There we go. One more. Ooh, pizza. Do you remember what happened the last time we had pizza from this location? <laughs> yeah, the game crashed. Let's hope that doesn't repeat itself. Speaking of, the game hasn't crashed. Touch wood. A single time yet. Do we have another suitcase? Oh, no money here. I'm gonna treat myself to some cake. Oh, there is, there's one there. Let's see if we can get another like 60 grand or something. Oh my god, 185 grand. That's ridiculous. Suddenly we just got loads of money. Maybe that's why we get so much money, because we, we might need to buy some Zombrex. No! I spoke too soon. My first crash. It's that bloody pizza, I'm telling you. Screw that pizza. Oh my god, what the hell? I told you it's all the pizza's fault. There's no way that's normal. This pizza, it's demonic. 
Alright, uh, we made it. Get off me, zombie. Alright, let's get rid of this van and complete this case. Here we go. Yeah, your plan has been foiled, TK. Settle down. I've got a meeting with my source tonight. I think maybe it's time you met. Oh, oh yeah. the sauce. I guess I'm not Who is it? Jacks. Benny Jacks, an Americana. Okay, sounds good to me. What time? 12 a.m. All right, we got a little bit of time to burn. All right, I need to get that truck to despawn, and then I'm gonna try and go in and see if I can use the keys on the the vaults inside. All right, there we go. So it's despawned. Let's head inside. Oh my god. What is with the jump scares in this game? Ooh, 150 grand. We've got half over half a million now. That's bonkers. Alright, here we go. So do we use it here? No? Wait. We don't use the keys in here? I was like confident that this is where we use the keys where else would you use them it's got to be in the new area then it's got to be in uranus zone it has to be i can't think of anywhere else where you would possibly use them other than where i've just been all right well we need to get over to wilted flower because we need we want that shortcut because that's going to be helpful and then we're going to take out slappy after that i think and then I'm going to head to Uranus Zone and see if I can figure out where the hell we use these keys. Right, actually, I think first we'll take out Slappy because if we grab the girl first, Slappy might end up killing her. Let's do this, Slappy. Hello, Slappy. It's nice to see you again. I'm good at stuff. Okay. <laughs> Fix that toy. Wait, he thinks it's a toy in this one? He said it was his girlfriend in the other one. Now he's saying it's, it's a toy. I can't help you fix your toy, mate. Sorry. He might be even crazier than he were in the original. Holy cow. Stop shooting me. Right, we almost got him. Right, last hit. <laughs> Sucker. Oh god, he's still rolling with the broken. They're both broken. big toy box wait so even he thinks he's a toy at least in the originally you know he knew he was a human <laughs> where the hell did that zombie just fall from all right well let's go and get the tanned lady so we can get the shortcut what is Frank talking about <laughs> yo Frank's looking a bit older in this one let's give him some gray hair rock that gray hair brother here we go <laughs> take me to brand new you for my shortcut assuming she still takes me to that no right, she's which is good. Right, I won't forget your massager this time. I'll bring it with me. Yeah. Nope, I didn't want to carry her. Get get down. I was trying to give you the massager for crying out loud. All right, come on. Ooh, I got a trophy. No zombies in the vents. <laughs> All right, where's Tan Lady? There's Danny. I need to find Tan Lady. I've got a gift. There she is. Thank you. You're welcome. Here you go. I'll, I'll just put it over here where no one sees it. There you go. You, um... You take good care of that thing, okay? Oh, hello, Luz. Alright, come on, let's get the hell out of here. Ooh, trophy. Ninja uniform. Elite killer for killing 1,337 zombies. There's a woman in the underground, and a few of TK's goons are shooting at her. She oh. Help. Okay. Wax on, wax off. Okay, Mr. Miyagi. Alright, I can hear them. Alright, here we go. Alright, 
I've got you. And this is perfect, because like I said, I can now steal... How many times do I have to run these guys over? What the heck? This is a new character. Oh, that's why it's called Wax on Wax it Off. She's got a little uh, karate kit on. Does she like beat the crap out of the zombies then? Because she's a karate master or what? Oh my gosh, she actually does. <laughs> oh my god, that's so that's so cool. Oh my god. I like kind of didn't expect it to actually be a thing. That's so freaking cool. Alright, come on, Tomo. A Tomo. Let's go, you karate expert. <laughs> How much cooler would it have been if the trophy was to take that character all the way through the game? I'd better get a little a cut of that cash in that briefcase, my guy. Let's see if he gives me any. You show signs of a strong fire. Why, thank you. Kept your word, here's a little something for the troubles. Oh, buy something nice, okay. How much? 20 grand. You freaking stingy little shit. There's at least about 500 grand in that briefcase. Give me 20 grand. I'm listening. I saw a postal cart driving around Royal Flush Plaza. Check it out. There might oh, be nice. Zombrex in one of those packages. Yep, we're gonna get a Zombrex. Special delivery! Signature required! <laughs> I wonder what his issue is going to be this time then, because last time it was because Chuck, he thought Chuck started the, the outbreak, so what will be the issue now? Signature required. Whatever, man, if it makes you feel better. can use that anyway. Okay. Oh, yeah, there we go. What's the problem? You're not the addressee. That's mail fraud, sir. And mail fraud is a federal crime. Oh, now he's doing it just because Can you hold it? mail fraud? Okay. I feel like it made way more sense in, in the original. Bye. Yep, you might want to get rid of that. Throw it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Get out of there. He's going to be even more annoyed now. He can't do any of his deliveries. You tamper with America. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright, let's go get ourselves some Zombrex, which we really need. There we go. Ooh, psychopath clothes required. Acquired, not required. <laughs> Can I have my special delivery, please? I need this song. Thank you. Sorry. I actually really do need it because I, I don't think I've got any. Ah, boom. You got some weird looking blood, my guy. All right. Oh my god, are his feet left? <laughs> Is that his feet? <laughs> right, we got one Zombrex. Oh my god, it's his feet. <laughs> it's his shoes with smoke coming out of them. Oh my god. Did that ha I don't know if that happened in the other one. That's hilarious. All right, so it looks like we're getting super close now to case five. When does it start? 12. And we're on... All right, we're pretty much at 12 o'clock. Hey, Rebecca? You in here? Thank you, thank you, please! Help me, please! <laughs> oh, what the hell? Oh, this is totally different. Has TK got TK. Rebecca? He wants me to get him money. A million dollars? By seven? What? I'm gonna have to go and earn some money and then get to the nightclub. Oh yeah, this is the mission where the twins, the twins take Rebecca, don't they? This time it's TK and he wants a million dollars. Oh my god, and I have to get it to him before seven? Where am I gonna, how much money have I got? Oh okay, I've got a decent amount. It makes sense now then why we've been getting so much money. Because you don't get nowhere near as much money like this in, in the original, so it makes sense now why we've been getting so much cash. So I need 100 and, 180 grand. Definitely a decent amount, but... Ooh. I still don't know what to do with these, though. If I could figure out what these are for... I mean, unless they're, they're like, maybe something... Like when you complete the game, maybe the, the unlock and give you, I don't know, like upgrades or something? So, what am I going to do for this money? The, the best thing I can think of is I go and explore the new area to see if there's somewhere there where I can use the keys. That's my best bet, I think, right now. Oh, no. The snipers are in the strip. 
all four of them. The freaking redneck snipers. Well, I'm gonna have to watch out for those now. Come here for you, big girl. Ow. What the hell? Why is his health not draining? I swear sometimes you hit them and it just does like no damn. What the hell? What the hell? Is he bugged out? What the hell? He was, he shoot, bro, that is meant to be a sniper, not an assault rifle. He's shooting it like it's a freaking marksman rifle instead of a sniper. But at least he's not hitting me. Damn, I'm so lucky that didn't start happening when I was like further away, because there's no chance I would have been able to get up here if he were just shooting like that. I hope the other enemies don't do that, because I'm screwed. <laughs> Come on, Johnny, let's go. What the hell? Yo, th th they were not like this on the uh, original. They're like borderline broken on this. They just randomly start firing like crazy speed. I mean, if it weren't for me being able to like just glitch and stand right next to them, I would legitimately be completely screwed. Finish him off with my lightsaber. That's got to be a glitch, them firing like that fast. There's no way that's intentional. Oh well, two down, two to go. Maybe it is intentional, they're all doing it. I can't get to it. That is insane. Right, there's only one more left. Right, well, I'm going to save the game and do what I originally intended, which was to go and explore Uranus Zone. All right, let's look around this place properly and see if we can figure something out. I mean, this says VIP access. I wonder if that's something. No? Let's have a look at the map. See if anything would give us an indication of where it would be. Ooh, Fortune City Bank. If it's going to be anything in this area... The bank sounds like is where it would be. All right, I think I'm going the right way. Does that say bank there? Get off my balls, love. Fortune City Bank, welcome. All right, let's have a look in here. This has got to be it, right? I mean, even if it isn't, if it's a bank, we might get loads of money at least. Ooh, 10 grand for breaking the machine. Can we even open it? Ooh, security clearance accepted. <gasps> this is it. Oh my god, we found it. No way. Nice. Okay, so we opened that. And it gave us 10 grand. Nine, nine, nine. Great. 25 grand and some Zombrex. Oh my god, hell yeah. Right, we'll just try and open all the ones we can. There we go, another yeah. one. Did that seriously just give me 100? Yes. What waste of time that one was. Can I open any more? Oh, number one, 50 grand, super close to a million, 666, I don't even want to know what's in there, the devil will pop out, there we go, another one, <gasps> more Zombrex, oh my god, we have hit the jackpot, you love to see it, oh my god, there's a money case, how much, come on, 10 grand, I'll take it, well, I'm not complaining, we got, what, two Zombrexes, I think? So now we just need to earn, what, 36 grand and we can uh, we can pay the ransom of a million, which is ridiculous. Oh, it's Richard. He's here instead of uh, on the strip. Oh, that means he wants food and he's there. Have I got any food? Oh, nice. I've got food. We're good. I'll give him the coffee, drink it and let's go. Sweet. Here he is, Seymour. He's back at it again. How you doing, buddy? Still just as crazy as he was before. Yep. Yeah, so I feel like the best way to do it is to hit them once and then just move away. There we go. Oh, you twice the man. I guess we'll find out in a second. Oh, yeah. Let's get a gruesome picture. It's all for my book that I'm going to sell after we survive this thing. All right, next up, we're going to go to bank run. So I think this is that other guy that I thought was there before, you know, the guy with the money. Ah, so this is where Bill is in the original. 
but we found Bill somewhere different. He's the guy that runs around the ATMs taking the money out. So this guy might give me some extra money. The other guy was stingy, maybe this guy won't be. He didn't take out all the money, noob. Ooh, 10 grand though. Ooh, super close now as well to a mil. Only 16,000 more. Come on, bro, you do your thing. I've got the zombies, it's fine. Okay, I'm trying to keep them off you, bro, but it's difficult. There's a lot of zombies around here. Just do your thing, bro, I'll keep them off you. That's right, I got them. Are you, are you doing your thing? Are you good? Did, did you do it? Okay, I think you did it. I'm gonna steal what, what's left. 10 grand each time. Hurry up, I'm right behind you, bro. Right, and then if I break those two when he's done with them, we'll have a million. All right, there's my million. I gotta be careful around here, because one of the snipers is still alive. I just don't know where he is. I know he's around, because the, uh, the boss fight music's on, but I just don't know where he is. Oh, I hear him sniping. Where is he? Oh, Deets. Now I remember. I, like, hugged this wall in, in my other video, what I did for Dead Rising 2. I, like, hugged the wall and went round. I think I went up there before, and he wasn't there. Right, he's done. Thank God for that. Right, come on, let's go. Should we try and take Deets out as well? Come on, Woodrow. We're going to take out Deets. It's you and me, brother. Oh my god, every time, bro. Every time. I'm coming for you, Deets. Get him, Woodrow. Ooh, we got him. That was close. That was too close. Have some snacks. Oh, he won't take it because he thinks I'm going to try and take his case. Bro, there's more important things right now than your stupid briefcase, bro. Alright, let's get this noob back to the safe house and then we can give TK the million. Money we took, I mean collected. Put it to good use. A little something for your help. How much? How much we talking? Bro! Five grand? Oh my god, all these characters are so stingy with the money. And the ones that you wouldn't think were, like, didn't have much money give you the most. Frank, you better bring some more Zombrex for Jared. Nope, oh, Jared needs some more Zombrex. To, get... Something else as well. Police officer? Okay. It's not her from Dead Rising 1, is it? <laughs> I hope not. Okay, I don't know if I could put up with her again. Yo, Deidre, 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 I don't know what your name is, but I like you. I like your clothes. So this is a totally new character again. Maybe I can show you sometime. Uh, I mean, maybe when there's not zombies around, you know what I mean? Come on. This way. I've got four guys that would love to meet you back at the safe house. You are just the kind of lady they've been waiting for. They like board games. The nerds. They probably love cosplay. Definitely your type. Well, you're definitely their type. <laughs> I don't know if, if they're yours. But it is a zombie apocalypse, so I guess beggars can't be choosers, you know? Thanks, papi. Okay. Oh, she got an extra cash for me. Oh, of course, of course, it's 6,900. What was I expecting? Right, let's go give um, Jared his, his Zombrex before he dies. There you go, buddy. All for you. We got level up out of it as well. Health increase, new skill move. You spot any hot girls out there? I mean, I've just brought one back, mate. Literally just now. Get back to Get the, back safe, to the house. safe house. Richard is harassing, some He's of harassing the, girls, the girls. Oh, for God's sake, Richard. You at it again. Right, I'm guessing Richard's hungry. So I'm going to make sure I take him some food. Theater at the slot ranch. Oh, no, it's BB. All right, so if it's anything like Dead Rising 2, I am going to need a tuxedo. Here we are. Tuxedo. There we go. Let's put the shoes on as well. We're going to dress smart. We might as well go the whole way. Can I change the uh, the mask? Because I'm not sure if I'm not sure if she'll be feeling the mask, you know. Okay, I can't change the mask. Right. Hopefully, it doesn't creep her out. What's wrong with the conditions? Yes, you are. All right. We need to be careful because they got bombs under the chairs. Okey doke. Damn, that camera shot. Calm down. To refresh. Oh yeah, I need to get her a drink as well, don't I? She's thirsty. Um, of course, she's thirsty. Thirsty for my di- There you go. Have a coffee. Let's get the firecrackers. Let's attract some zombies. 
Right, you got a crowd going there. Surely that's enough. You need more? There's loads. There's a freaking army of zombies right there. Yeah, there we go. We're done. Can't you just feel the energy? I can I can feel the energy, yeah. Alright, let's go start the show. She needs some help backstage. Okie doke. We're adoring audience. It's fucking zombies. <laughs> Yo, man, just do it. <laughs> Easy. Oh, why, thank you. And there she goes. I wonder if we can save her again like in the other one. We can. Nice. I am a true fan. Alright, come on. Come back with me. Go into a safe house. You're all coming. You're all invited. Come on. You as well, Alison. Oh my god, another fabulous tour. Don't spend it all in one place. A hundred dollars? <laughs> oh my god. It gets worse. Oh my god, we leveled though. And we got some attack damage. Super slicer. Nice, nice. What the hell's wrong with you, Richard? You need your shit. Oh, hi, Frank. Uh, oh, yeah, he was annoying the women, innit? Better acquainted with some of the ladies. What's wrong with you, bro? You've been left it bottled up for long enough. What the hell, bro? Are you... Are you busting? Is my guy busting? Oh, God. The annual girlfriend. So there might be a magazine that'll help in hotter Excitorama. Oh, my God. A magazine that's frisky. I've got to go and get him a porno mag. I need something to occupy my mind. We need to go and get him an adult magazine. Release some tension. Oh, my God. Okay. I will be back, Richard. You dirty man. I've just noticed as well the mission's called Snake in the Grass. <laughs> There we go. Sexy costumes. This is where we want to be. Right, where's this magazine? There it is. Yep, that is definitely the magazine. Erotic magazine. Right, let's drink this. Grab the butt. And dash over there quickly. Right, I've got your magazine, Richard, you dirty man. Here you go. Oh, a trophy as well. Team player. I averted a mutiny. Nice. Well, you can uh, take care of yourself now, Richard. Just, you know, keep the magazine. Don't get it too dirty because I ain't getting you another one. And leave the bloody women alone for crying out loud. Yo, Sully, sort him out, please. Okay, here we go. I've got your million, TK. Give me Rebecca. Any lower and you're going to have to pay for it, pal. <laughs> oh my God, Frank. <laughs> He kind of looks like TK's brother or something, this guy. Got the same sideburns. We're all rude. There's Rebecca. Right, so I'd imagine it's going to be the same as the original, where we only really need to kill one of the twins. We're going to tackle Amber. I don't remember which one we killed last time, but it's going to be Amber this time. Did she just say, did your back go out? <laughs> oh my god. Yo, Amber. Where are you going? Is she trying to hide from me? Alright, let's drink a beer. Sorry, Crystal, not interested in you. It's your twin I like. Amber, come here. I've got a bat with your name on it. There we go. Oh, GG. Come on, Rebecca. We got a story to cover. <laughs> gonna lay here all day. Oh my god. It's about time. You'd almost think you liked me being tied up. They were your source. There's a lot of uh risque hey jokes in I'm this. Sorry. Imagine how much they'd have to cut Maybe out of this game if they made a remake. The uh, there we go, helicopter on the roof. Which means, just like in Dead Rising 2, I'm gonna go find myself a toy gun. And a trophy as well. Save the girl. Alright, I forgot my toy gun, so I'm not going to be able to take out in two seconds. So we're doing it the hard way. There he is. Where do you think you're going, TK? Hey, yo, fun. yo, she's your good friend, Frank. Look at that. Frank can move for an old guy. Oh, wow, that damage. Oh, sugar. Oh, God. My health. Ooh, that was close. I don't know what's happened to my health bar. It's like bugged out. Definitely should have brought my toy gun like I did in Dead Rising 2. 
This is way more difficult. <laughs> right, let's bring it down. Oh my god, look how much damage that thing just did. Uh oh. I don't know if I could have cut that any closer. GG, TK. There goes your chopper, your escape, and your money. Now TK's broke, just like I am. Throw him on there. I'm also going to need to eat some food because I'm almost dead. Alright, next one doesn't begin until 9am. So we have got plenty of time. Oh, are you good now, Richard? Did you relieve yourself? Well, from the looks of things you did, so... Happy days. Where's all the bloody food around this place? Oh yeah, Richard freaking ate it all. Alright, let's go check out Snow Day. A clown car. Oh, it's the clown car we've seen a few times. Oh, we got a totally new boss. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, okay. I'm getting like... Adam the Clown from the first game vibes. Hey down there, little fella. <laughs> okay. I gotta go. Let's get out of here. Oh, you know all right. Flavor would you like, young man? The flavor of Can go I away. More flavors back in the car. I don't think you're gonna sell a lot of ice cream right now. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh no. I mean, to be fair, I've got a mask on. Can you even tell? I've got grey hair, I've got a mask on. Frank West. No, I'm Frank East. No, I've heard of you. Oh, this never goes well. Oh god. His brother. Oh! Wait, is this his... Adam the Clown's brother? What? What? Oh wow, okay, that's a cool little uh, throwback. If Adam was your brother, <laughs> I'd hate to meet your sister. Oh shit. How about a little ice cream? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, cool. A totally new boss fight, I love it. Heaven. Get down here. I'm fighting wise on stilts. Ooh. Okay. Oh, I'm like sliding on the ice. Come down. Oh my god. I'm surprised we're not fighting him at the uh, the new area, though. I wonder if we get a, a weapon that like is super overpowered like we did from Adam. I mean, in Dead Rising 1, all you need to do is beat Adam pretty early in the game. Grab his chainsaws, grab the two books to make it last for like 2,000 kills, and you can just go and get it again. As soon as it breaks, you can literally just go and get another one. And you can use that the whole way through the game because it's by far the best weapon. All right, it's not too bad. It's pretty easy. He's got a lot of health. He's not really doing much damage. Oh. Probably another phase two. I don't think I fully got rid of all his health. Man, that guy had a short fuse. Well, there's not any stilts anymore. Oh my god, we're even getting the Willamette music. And he's whistling it. <laughs> Oh wait, he's dead small. No wonder he's on stilts, he's tiny. <laughs> he's chasing me, he's so small. <laughs> oh god, I don't want to try any flavors, bro. What do you mean? Go away, you little turd. <laughs> oh my god, look at him, he's so short. Oh god, oh the, the zombies are attacking, he's chasing me. <laughs> Go away. Get away from me. Oh, this is hilarious. Oh, he's... Oh, God. He's beating me up. Oh, no. <laughs> I just kicked him like a football. <laughs> Come here, you look. Oh, get off me. Oh, my God. He's, he's pretty quick for a small guy. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> get out of here, Evan. Right, we almost got him. Oh, we tripped. Oh, my God. The music. There we go. We got him.
So I'm guessing we're going to get his, his weapon, his little ice launcher, snowball gun thing. Can even reach his vehicle. <laughs> He's got, he got, oh, he got reach. He needs his stilts. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, he's freezing. Oh my god. This is going to turn into Jack Nicholson. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh god, that cracked me up as well. That was hilarious. Right, we got a new combo. Snowball cannon. Fire extinguisher and a water gun. We'll have to try that out. Got a level up. Handy chipper. Attack damage up as well. Hell yeah. Should we try his gun out? Snowball cannon. Get 40 shots. Oh, it just pops them. You just like explode. The range on it's not very good though. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Definitely not on the level of uh, the chainsaws from Adam, that's for sure. Fireworks going on. Strange time to be performing. Oh, okay. Is it the two crazies, the two magic dudes? Uh, let's go see a magic show. No, oh, the most dangerous magic trip. Well, I definitely see the dangerous part, but. Yeah, definitely see the, the dangerous part, but magic, not so much. What is that on his face? Take my katana to the face. Oh god, they do a lot of damage. Now we can stun Roger. Whoa, what was that damage? I'm guessing because he stunned him, I just did like ridiculous damage to him there. That's a nice little, uh, I had no idea about that. There we go, that's one of them. Alright, where's your mate? Where you at, Roger? There he is. Come on, Roger, let's go. Last hit. Oh, no, one more. Trying to attack me. Oh, he dodged me. I keep missing. There we go, we got him. Damn, Roger. Calm yourself. I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> God. Come back to the safe house. Oh. No. Okay. What does she want? She still hasn't got any clothes. What the hell, bro? Is there no clothes around for you to wear? A plant? Oh, I remember this one. I think someone else wanted this quest last time, though. There it is. Give me the plant. Alright, Europa. I've got your plant. I'm not sure why you're asking for a plant, though. You should be asking for some clothes, but... You know. There it is. Ooh, dominoes. I use the jump kick to knock down 100 zombies. All right, we're ready for case 7-1. Help arrives. Here comes the gas. Turning them into super zombies. All right, well, all of his crew are dead. GG's. There he is, there's Boykin. And he's got Rebecca. We need to save her. Smack me straight on the ground. Shoot me in the balls. Oh, I can throw grenades. Ooh, assault rifle. Ooh, he does a lot of damage. It's over for you, Boykin. Trophy as well. Save the girl. Again. All right, let's get Rebecca back to safety. Yo, what up, fellas? How's it going? One second, Rebecca. Come with me, Sergeant Wu. Uh, at least they can defend me. All right, we made it back with Rebecca. And the two soldiers as well. Uh-oh. The zombies are in the bloody safe house. Operation, close the gate. Go on, survivors. Make you stand. Don't die on me. Boom. Right, generator. Down. Go on, Wade, get him. Right, spool of wool. Down. Right, what do I need? Gas barrel. Got it. There we go. Hack the panel. Come on, Frank. Do it. Hack. Spam that X button like you've never spammed it before. Close, goddammit. Close. Boom. That was not an accident. 
safe house is well a safe house again get tk the little turd trying to get out of here oh he's about to get a love bite uh, well at least he's not dead i suppose he is infected now though <laughs> It's like they're gonna blow blow the place up. Whoa, right, we're heading to the underground. TK's infected. Let's go give him some bloody Zombrex. Looks like we've reached our destination. This is all new. They're not like all boarded up and stuff in uh, the second game. All right, we've arrived underground. That's where all the zombies are heading. Facility hidden down here with a load of soldiers. Ooh, the scientists are down here. And they don't seem too happy that I'm down here. Oh, all right, fellas. Okay, that was easy. All right, we made it back to the safe house. We've got the laptop with some details. And I've got some new bling. I'll call my station. They'll send help. No, Rebecca. Ooh, plot twist. Switching it up on us. So she's the one behind it. Party going on in Fortune Park. Seriously? Bro, there's no way it's just crashed again. Twice in a row. I've just lost my, like, 20 minutes of progress again. Oh my god. What the hell, man? It crashes every time? Is it just broke? It's just crash crashing every single time. Alright, I've read a few things online to fix it. Apparently, disconnecting the Wi-Fi, so I've done that. And another thing is just spam X super fast soon as we go in. Also, wait outside for a few seconds. No idea why. Then go in. Spam X. Didn't work. Oh my god, bro. I don't know what to do. After having it crash another 10-ish times in a row, I gave up and decided to try again the next day. Oh my god. It worked. Engaged the facts. Please, yes, save and continue. Please do not crash. I have no joke, no word of a lie, retried this thing about 13, 14 times and finally I've got it to work. I couldn't tell you what fixed it because I've tried loads of different things. I'm just happy. I can now progress in the game, so let's continue. 17 hours until the bombs. So I'm not sure what I have to actually do here. Uh, goal stop Stacy. Fortune Park. All right, let's go. What is going on here? Oh, they brought the machine from underground. Where was this? Harvesters? Oh, we gotta destroy them? I'm gonna have to deal with these guys first. Yeah, okay, we gotta destroy the harvesters. Does this one work? What's this one do? Blast frequency. I don't know if that does that damage it. Kind of. Ooh, a trophy. Technological terror. That was the last one. Destroyed all of the harvesters. I don't know how many I destroyed right there, but it felt like about 15. Oh, we're gonna have to go take out Stacy. She's looking like freaking Jill Valentine or something. What the hell? Did she legit just say you're gonna come and play on my ride? Like, bro, Stacy, chill, chill. About time you showed up. All right, I'm here, Stacy. Do you want to fight? Let's do it. You and Cure are killing all those people. You're harvesting human beings. Is he legit just picked up a chair to sit down and have a chat? <laughs> Whoa, what the hell? No boss fight? She said little toy, bro. This is not little. Wait, what do I do? Oh my god. This is the weirdest Dead Rising boss fight I've ever seen. I'm not even... I'm not damaging her, I don't think. Maybe I need a melee weapon. Oh, we got weapons in here. Assault rifle. Let's try and smack this. 
I'm doing nothing to it. I don't see like a weak... Oh, maybe that red thing there. Hold up. Oh. Okay. I think I went that... Was that that... I think I hit it there? Wait, can I... Why does it say I can grab that? What the hell? Wait, one minute I'm doing damage and then I'm not. And I'm so confused. This is a confusing boss fight. Can I jump up? Oh, maybe I'm supposed to climb up. Oh, that's damaging it. Okay, I think I've basically got to make all the blue parts red. Is that what's going on? This boss fight is terrible. <laughs> Super zombies in this game piss you off. Yeah, they are pretty annoying. They're like ridiculously aggressive and really strong. Okay, I can hit the sides with mail. Okay, okay. This is going to take a while. I should have brought my spiked bat to do extra damage, I think. Grab the crowbar. What do the two stars mean? Does that mean I've got to do this twice? I hope not. This is... This boss fight is bad. Holy shit. I appreciate them trying to do, do something a little different, but... Yeah, I ain't feeling it. I wonder if just smacking it with this will work. Oh my god. Okay, that works. Okay. Right, phase two. Fuck this boss, man. It's so shit. Oh my days. Oh my... Bro, stop. Fucking hell, hit it. I'm doing like no damage, bro. What the fuck? This is so crap. <laughs> this is the worst boss fight I've ever faced in Dead Rising, ever. Absolutely horrendous. What were they thinking when they made this? Who's like designed this boss and then like everyone play tested it and was like, yeah, this is a good boss. They're gonna love this one. Smack him with my wood. Come on. <laughs> Just slam and die already. Oh we're, more, oh, we're doing a bit of damage. Hopefully not a third bar. Oh, please, no. Don't tell me there's a third bar. Are we good? Are we done? Are we done? Bro, what are we talking about? You've got no health. What are we even doing? I just eliminated your health bar. I got hit once more or something? Bro, what? The there we go. Woo! We're done. Oh my god, that was crap. Brilliant camera angle there. There's a fucking third health bar, bro. What are we doing? What the shit? Why does it say I can grab this item? I can't. It's huge, bro. I cannot grab that thing. Oh, I can go up here, I think. Oh, we got platforms. Activate rack. Uh... Wait, I've got to go over and smack her. Run, Frank, you slow ass. Fight Stacy. Kick her off. Oh, shit, I need to press buttons. Get her, Frank. Come on, my guy, you can do it. Get her. Yo, they are fighting pretty quick. Oh, I fell out. I'll beat her up a little bit, you know what I mean? Well, I'll take it. I just got... Whoa! Frank, my guy. Can I do this again? Oh, there's another one on the other side. Go. Activate rack. Go, 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 go. Get a Frank. Round two. Alright, last one. Whoa, my guy Frank, did you see that shit? He just got knocked off, did a flip and landed on his feet. What a fucking chad, mate. Shit. This is it. The music sounds so epic, but like the fight's just the complete opposite. <laughs> yeah, we just got her. She's... Boom. True colors. Get out of here, Stacy, old oh, pube. There we go. Fucking hell, I'm glad that's over. What an athlete. <laughs> yo, yo, not the camera. Looks like you're a little. Don't know what's so funny. I just beat the shit out of you a second ago. I'm ready for extraction. Yeah, I just have an old newspaper. That needs to be taken out to the trash. Oh shit, Stacy. Oh fuck, she just got flatlined. Always thought you had a crush on me. Oh my god, Frank. Frank, my guy. What was that? Too bad I don't dig flat chicks. Oh my god, Frank! Oh my god! Fucking hell, I'm glad I don't have to do that shit again. Never again, mate. Never again. I've got to redo the game, other like playthroughs, but 
Thankfully, I don't have to play this far, so I never have to see that boss ever again. I mean, if that's how the bosses are going to be when they try something different, just stick to... <laughs> <laughs> Just stick to the usual psychopaths, please. We got the fake out. We're finished. Except we're not, because we know we've got to deal with TK. All right, I'm skipping that, because that's... I don't know, I was going to say maybe that's copyright, but maybe not. This song's actually not that bad. <laughs> it was better than that boss fight. West! <laughs> it's Frank West! What? I feel like there's more effort in this song than that boss fight. Is that just me? That's fucking disgusting, bro. Promising photo. Oh, have I got a... Oh, fucking hell. I forgot I've got to get all the crap for him, haven't I? I ran around quickly grabbing everything for TK so I could finally bring this whole thing to a close. Silk thong? Bro, what the fuck? Who knows, though? Maybe, uh, you know, when I... Play Dead Rising 4 again. Maybe I'll enjoy it more than I did when it first released on PC. All right, it looks like we're in a wrestling ring or something. I don't know. Okay, this is different. Survive. Oh, we got steel chair. Jesus. Whoa, whoa, one at a time, one at a time. <laughs> All right, let's stand on this for a second. So they Oh, right, I need to heal. Ooh, excuse me. Well, at least we don't get a 10 second ring out or anything. All right, I think it's time for the uh, showdown with TK. Still chair shot to the dome, TK. Have a spotlight. Spam the X button, Frank. I don't know what he's doing to her, but... Oh, shit. Oh, my God, I'm almost dead. Oh, my God, he's beating her up. Jesus. Oh my god, I'm pressing wrong button. No! Shit. Shit. Shh. I might be dead here. He's gonna shoot me. No! How am I not dead? Now I'm dead. Right, this is the one. Oh shit! Oh my god, that, that lunge is insane. Right, I feel like we gotta finish him with a steel chair shot. It only feels right. Shh. Steel chair to the face, TK. Oh. Ooh, save the girl yet again. I think that's like the third time I've saved Rebecca now. Like, come on, man. Bye, TK. Bro, are they legit trying to tell us that Frank and Rebecca become a thing in this version? Like, bro, what? Oh, for God's sake. Right? We did it. We beat it. Play through one in the bag. Now I want to play through two. My goal here was to complete a few more trophies, with the main three being for getting eight survivors into that clown car from earlier, never eating meat, dairy, or alcohol, and saving the first survivor, Dense, and keeping her alive until the military arrive. The thing that makes keeping Dense alive a little tricky is that I can never have her enter the safe room. So I'm gonna have to think outside the box. Let's go, go, go. So basically, the way I'm gonna do this is since I can't like drink alcohol I can't eat any dairy or uh, meat and stuff that's limits your food quite a lot so what I'm probably gonna do just so I'm not wondering what does and doesn't count I'm just gonna stick to combo drinks and orange juice and that's all I'm gonna really eat just to uh, to play it safe all right, let's kill these and then I can get dense. All right, here we go. My girl dense. Now she's with me. We've got to keep her until the end of the game. I'm honestly not confident I'm going to keep her alive the whole time, which is why I'm going to have to make sure I save quite a lot. All right, so we've got another orange juice. Right, let's just grab the Zombrex. And there's an orange juice there. We should be able to get another three orange juice from here. So I think these always spawn in here. So I'm pretty much going to be coming back to this area a lot. Anytime I'm, I'm in need of orange juice, this is where I'll be coming. Yo, Snowflake, get your ass over here. I got some steak for you. Is he going to eat it? I think he's eating it. Hold up. Drama. Boom. That should be the trophy, I think. Yeah, there we go. Raw emotion. 
Hell yeah. All right, boom. I've got eight survivors. Now I've just got to go and get myself a clown car. And hope none of them die before then. Oh, all right. Wait, what? Whoa, 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 what the hell? Who's dying? I just saved the game as well, no fucking way. There's no way that's just happened. That's insane. There's no way. No way. Wait. I might be able to save this. I might be able to save this. This is the problem. I just saved. And even though I saved, she's going to die before I get there. Every time. So I think I can maybe remedy this. If I quit and load checkpoint, that should reload me just entering this room. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. Woo! I was worried for a second there. That was... That was close. I almost balls that up. Thank God for the checkpoints. <laughs> oh, that could have been bad. Oh, it's there, look. There it is. There's my clown car. It spawned. Hell yes. Right, all I've got to do now is jump on it. Drive over to my crew. They should all jump inside. And we should get the trophy. Come on, get in everyone. Bill, Jack, Lenny. Come on, Lenny. Gordon, Lissandra, get in. I forgive you for the orange juice incident. Kristen, Dense, Kenneth. Yeah, there we go. Cramped quarters. We got it. Hell yeah. Now I can uh, either kill the other seven survivors or try and take them back safe. All right, so what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to command them to... Run over there. Uh, hello. And then I'm going to give her that. And close the door on her. That actually works perfect. So if I ever want to bring survivors back, that actually works flawlessly. Just give her a drink. And while she's busy drinking, just trap her behind the door and then I can take the other survivors back. She's probably sick of coming back here at this point. I mean, we she basically got trapped Thank here. I so saved her. So told her I was going to take her to a safe house. And I've just had her following me around the whole time. Constantly bringing her right back to where we started. She must think I'm a right asshole. Uh, oh, they've got... So Wait, why'd I get a trophy? Hands of Doom. Unlock all skill moves. No! She defected. Oh no, that's bad. That's really bad if she's just defected. I think that basically means if I hit her one more time at any point, I think she's gonna defect. So freaking cool. Oh, another trophy. Card archive. Oh, oh, oh. Pure Wall Memorial Cup. That's one of the trophies. So that was not eating the uh not eating any meat or dairy or whatever until the military arrives so that's the first one so now all i need to do is i need to get dense to attack boykin all right here we are it's time we're almost done come on dense right there he is now we just gotta get dense to attack him and we're good she don't even need to kill him she just needs to hit him come on dense you can do it Go on, Dance. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Yeah, there it is. Oh my, get off her, bruh. There we go. Alpha versus Omega. We done it. Oh my god, finally. That was uh, that was quite the journey getting her all the way through through the game. It was like, what, seven hours of gameplay just to get the trophy to get her to the end? It's kind of crazy. Kind of crazy, but we're done. And now she's getting her ass beat. I kind of want to keep her alive now, though, you know? She's been with me so long. I feel like... I feel like a connection to her, to be fair. She's like my best friend now. I mean, she's doing pretty well, to be honest. Look. She's holding her own. 
Go on, last hit. Oh my god, she killed him. Yo, that is dense. You legend. That was good. We got it. And she's still alive, which is even better. And I'm going to keep her that way. Let's save her. Let's legit save Dense. I'm going to take her back I'm to the safe so house. Grateful. Oh my god. It's finally time. Dense. Bro, I don't care about the cutscene with Rebecca. I just want to see Dense. Seriously? I save Dense, and the moment I get back to the safe house, this happens? Bro, I feel terrible. I legit feel t absolutely terrible. It's been a long, long journey, though. I think it's about time I stop calling calling her Dense as well. We'll call her uh, Denise. Maybe that's how it's actually pronounced. She's earned my respect. <laughs> Denise is finally safe. Where is she? Where's my girl? Where you at, Denise? Denise? Where are you? Denise? I'm missing you. Where's my girl, Denise? She's missing. The hell is she? Denise? Don't do this to me. Denise? Denise? Denise, my girl, there she is. Yo, Denise! Denise, do you want some orange juice? Oh, there's your weapon as well. Here's your weapon. Do you want some orange juice? There's orange juice. I don't want to die! It's okay, you've got orange juice, you're safe. Denise, it's party time! We're getting drunk. You ain't stopping drinking until you're puking all over the floor. Two. Yeah, there we go, it only took two. Party time. Let's go, Denise. You're my girl. That's, you know, it's a good party when the night ends like that. There you go. Let's, let's have some more. There you go. You're, you're welcome. You're welcome. Don't mind the shoes. I can get new ones. Alright, so what is a party without a little bit of dress up? You know what I mean? Is it really a party without dress up? Get myself a cheeky little uh, hat. Pop over to brand new you. Come on, Denise. Get myself a cheeky handbag. Get myself some heels. Gotta look the part. I think all I need now is a cheeky little summer dress. There we go. <laughs> Frank West. Cross dresser. There we go. Look at him. Go on, Frank. You strut your stuff, my guy. Look at that walk. Damn. Looking good. Yo, Denise, check out my new outfit. Do you like it? All right. There it is. That's who we've been waiting for. Our boy Chuck. We've got Snowflake. Let's go. All right, there it is. Go get him, Snowflake. Get him. Get him, Snowflake. No, Snowflake, not the zombie. Get Chuck. Go on, Snowflake. Now's your chance. Yes! I got it! <laughs> Tiger Tamer. Thank you, Snowflake. Now that the main story is complete, I can jump into the new sandbox mode. Here, I won't have to worry about time, so I can just explore and mess around as much as I want. The first thing I did was start taking pictures for a bunch of trophies. I actually did this before starting the main game, so you might notice I'm currently at level one. Ooh, sandbox mode. Oh, our first challenge, rooftop massacre. Kill as many zombies as you can in 30 seconds. We can get 40 kills, we get 20 grand and a gold medal. That's my first trophy. Got a medal. All right, so I might actually be able to get a trophy here because I think I remember there was a trophy to have a zombie slip on some puke. So if I eat this moldy ass burger, I should puke. And then I can get a zombie to hopefully trip on it and not kill me. Yep, there we go, puking rolly. Nice. And they're all just slipping on my puke. <laughs> That's gross, but hilarious. So, let's begin. Let's take some pictures. That's good stuff. Hey, my first picture. Nice shot. I then took a picture worth over 1,000 PP. Another trophy. My second photo, photo school. 
Killed my 69th zombie. Got photo journalist for earning 10,000 PP from pictures. Quickly photoed my 25th PP sticker. Took my 30th picture, filling my camera. Raking in the trophies. And as is tradition at this point, I hit the gym, earning some bonus PP and getting Frank in better shape. Oh, we're back in the gym again. You know what that means. It's time to train and get some bonus PP. Oh, and I got a level up as well. And a new skill move. Nice, another level up. We got a health increase. And a combo card. And then we'll take a picture for some motivation. Back outside, I found Chuck and snapped a picture of him. Oh, what a nice shot. Trophy as well, camera crazy. Maintain in the city. 10 different maintenance rooms. And built a combo card that is new to off the record. New hotness. All right, this might be my final photo, possibly. Yeah, there we go. Award-winning photography. That's 75 PP stickers photographed. All right, so now that I'm done with the 72-hour mode, I've got to do everything in sandbox mode. I've got a few miscellaneous things I can do, but the main focus for this is obviously I need the 100,000 kills. But I also need to get a gold challenge on every single one of these challenges. Uh, some of the challenges are locked. To unlock the final challenge, I need to get 10,000 zombie kills. So I'm probably going to get the 10,000 kills now. And then I can start working on getting a gold on all of these challenges. These are the single player ones. If I press triangle, you can see I've also got a load of co-op ones as well. I need gold on all the single player and all of the co-op. So... This one uh, might take a while. I mean, getting 100,000 kills is probably going to take a while. For the 10,000 kills, I'm going to be heading to the underground. Because I need myself some bees. I need all the queens I can get. And a lot of them spawn down here. As you can see, there's tons. With the bees, I'm going to head into Atlantica Casino. Run over here. So, I'm not sure if this even works. It's my first time attempting it, so who knows. But I basically need to like slow walk into this poster. I think it's this poster. And get one of the zombies to grab me. And then if I do this. And then slam a B. Oh my god. That works. As you can see. I don't know how many kills they had. But I'm pretty sure it was about. I think it was under 2,000. And now all of a sudden I've got 5,000 kills. So now that I've done that one time, I know it works. That's perfect because that means instead of spending like 10 hours basically doing what I did in Dead Rising 2, which was drive up and down the strip in the uh, SUV, I'd probably have to do that like say for like 10 to 12 hours to get 100,000 kills. But if I just go back into Atlantica, respawn all the zombies and do this little trick over and over again, I'm going to be able to get that 100,000 kills in uh, probably about an hour. Obviously, once I run out of bees, I'll obviously have to go back down and uh, do it again. But uh, let's see if it works. So I'm on 5,000. Oh my god, look. 8,800. So yeah, this is going to cut that grind down immensely. Yep, there we go. 12,000 kills. Luggage code. So, uh... I guess I'll see you when I have 100,000. All right, this should be it. Yep, there we go. Six digits, over 100,000 kills. Beautiful. Now I've done this, I can probably start working on some of the miscellaneous stuff I've got to do. A couple of random little things. All right, so this first one I'm going to go for, I'm going to come into ye old toy box and grab a, uh, a couple of masks. All right, so and then I'm gonna run over here because I need to take a picture with uh, this uh, Uranus Zone woman in the background. So I'm gonna put a couple of uh, funny masks on the zombies. There we go. Going to take out a couple of zombies and I'm gonna snap a picture and hopefully, if all is good, I should get a trophy. There we go. Mixed messages. All right, so to be able to get the next 
trophy. I need to get a gold medal on this uh, rooftop challenge. So let's see if I can get that done. Got 30 seconds. I'm sure there's a better weapon than the one I've got, but it's just the one I've got right now in my hands. So hopefully it's good enough. Yeah, there we go. 40 kills. Not too bad. So now that we got a gold medal on Rooftop Massacre, I should get a new combo card. There we go. So I needed the Boomstick combo card for a trophy. Here we go. Maintenance room. Got myself a pitchfork and a shotgun. Here we go. And now all I need to do is hold square. Pump the geezer up. And I should get myself some prestigious PP. So, this next trophy, I'm going to go over to this booth in here. Uh, I'm in um, Uranus Zone. I'm going to get a whole boatload of these alien probes. There we go. I've got myself a full inventory of them. I'm then just going to come over here. I'm going to drop them all on the ground. Gonna get rid of these zombies because they're getting in my way. And then hopefully, I'm going to be able to take a picture, get another trophy. So let me see. Hey. Yep, there we go. Adult content. So now that I've done that, I can start pretty much just concentrating on getting all of the gold medals now. All right, my next challenge. Balloon man. Get the balloon over the giant craps table as fast as you can. For a gold, I've got to do it in 40 seconds. So I've got to get all the way up there. And I read online the only way of really getting up there fast enough is if we take a cheeky quick step. So let's give it a go. Go, 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 go. There's a lot of zombies. Damn, this is not what we want. That's even worse. We're wasting so much time. Go, go, go. Alright, so we're going up here. This is where you get the uh, little secrets up here with the sniper and stuff. Definitely making it more difficult though. There's not usually zombies up here. Alright, then where? This way. Oh, I thought I missed. Boom. Gold. Beautiful, beautiful. I snagged a sweet gold medal for placing 25 masks on zombies in record time. Used firecrackers to load 10 zombies into the ride, earning me a trophy. And 80 kills. <laughs> Bye. Oh, trophy as well. Safety check failed. Finally earned a gold medal in this challenge where I had to deliver 40 massages. This took me ages to complete and honestly had me raging, but my voice wasn't recording so I'll spare you it this time. Defeated the twins in under one minute. Used my chainsaw bike to kill 500 zombies again in record time. Oh yeah. Ooh, the challenge experience. I got a bronze medal on all single player challenges. Hmm. All right, here we go, Rooftop Massacre round two. Got one minute to kill 200. I prepped myself with a bunch of BFGs. So just gonna spam this thing and hope I take out enough of these buggers. This is gonna be the last challenge as well. 175, 10 more. All right, we got it. There it is. Basically gold, shoot one more shot. Yeah, there we go. Gold. That's the final gold challenge. Rooftop Massacre number two. And that should be the trophy. 229. My gold. There it is. Challenge Domination. That's a gold on all of the single player cha challenges. Now I've got to go back though and do them all again, but in co-op. Hopefully it's a little bit easier in co-op because honestly, with the right prep work, most are pretty easy. But there was a couple in there that were... Uh, a little bit annoying and frustrating and overall though more than that they just weren't that fun I, I didn't think they were very fun most of them would just repeats like kill this amount of enemies or blah 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 in time or these points just in different locations so uh, yeah not a fan of these uh these challenges yep best of friends boom while attempting this next challenge bomb chop decided to give me a serious beatdown. Alright, bro, Jesus, fucking. 
fucking going to town on me then, bro. The fuck? <laughs> Some might say this next part is a little karma. <laughs> I just. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> Come on, bro, you can do it. I believe. No! <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh shit. Right, again. Uh, it's good, it's good. Oh, I thought I missed it this time. You got it. Yeah, could tell with that one. Nice. <laughs> Two heroes, one balloon. Beautiful. We got it. Oh, trophy as well. Help from my friends. And after all that, it was finally time to earn a gold medal on the last challenge, which had us running around like complete idiots collecting 60 massages before the time runs out. I could then pop the final trophy and platinum. Thanks to Bomb Chop for being the best co op partner. And thank you for watching. Yo, this is rapid. Yo, we're gonna do this first try. No way. That's crazy. Alright, we need six and that's it. Yep, let's take them. There you go. Boom. Done. No way. First try, that's crazy. It, I'm not even joking, it literally took me about 10 to 15 attempts to, to pull this one off in uh, solo. Happy days, mate. That should be two gold trophies, I think. Or bronze and a gold. Oh, yeah. Hot coffee. 65. Beautiful. There it is. More help from my friends. That's the bronze one. And even more help from my friends. Get gold medal. All co-op challenges. Bro, I was worried about that one. Not going to lie. And we just absolutely bossed it. And now we've got to figure out what to do with all these, bro. I'm going to take a picture of them. <laughs> The final trophy. Take picture. Boom. And the platinum. Dead Rising 2 off the record trophy master. Are you throwing dildos at me, bro? Is that what's happening? Oh my god, bro. Can get him fucking violated by fucking flying dildos like what the fuck <laughs> bro that, that's raw bro at least the new <laughs>